Hello everyone and welcome back to week 13 of Project Live Fully. This was another tough week filled with, I think I put in another 60 hours at the day job and then across the whole group this was a tough week and not necessarily one of our most productive but Ray has some stuff going on in his personal life and his day job that's keeping him busy and Jay's still off in the mountains of Montana without much service and hopefully building some good content that he'll be able to share once he surfaces again. And Joseph's still trying to get his studio and everything else set up for starting out on this new project. And my mentor had some medical issues this week and we weren't able to work together as much as we'd hoped. But there were still some good things. We continued with the training. We continued working on videos. And I was able to help get the Project Live Fully Photo Challenge Facebook group. Uh, I think we got 32 new members this week. And our topic of animals and pets really got a lot of responses. We almost hit the goal. We hit 18 posts this week. So that was really great. Uh, we'll show those here now. the video I think that I saw one of Peter McKinnon's videos from this last week where he was talking about using a notebook and journaling and trying to set daily and weekly goals for himself and I was doing the similar thing with the notebook but I think that one of the issues that I've been having is that I'm setting these even my smaller goals were still bigger goals, like trying to finish a whole video or trying to hit these bigger things or learn these things or, and it's just these really time consuming tasks. And then you get discouraged from being able to accomplish those when the goals are too big and then you feel like you're not being very successful. But if you can divide it up into even more bite size chunks here, then I think that that'll allow me to continue to get those little boosts of encouragement and keep making progress forwards despite our complicated schedules. So this week, the mini goals that I'm gonna be working on, the ones that I hope that I can accomplish in two or three hours on any day, and that that's kind of the most that any one of these should take, is to one, read one chapter of the book, The Negative, that's the Ansel Adams second book that we got from my mentor. Two, complete two hours of tutorials and practice what I was learning from them. Research one, three, research one famous explorer photographer that's worked for National Geographic or a similar organization in the past and try to learn about their story. Four, create the real estate walkthrough video. Not the whole video, not the thing with the comparisons, but I just wanna get the part where it's just the actual video footage of the walkthrough of the house, like you would do for a real estate client to show off the house. So I just wanna get that like two to three minute presentation walkthrough video done and see if I can set that goal and get it accomplished. Goal five was to book and complete one mini session. Some of these do seem a little bit big still, but we'll see how they go. Six, find someone for the next short story um, to narrate the next one for my grandfather's stories. Um, not necessarily shoot the video, but just find the next person in line who's gonna narrate the next video after Jared did so good with the last one. And then seven, storyboard out some ideas. Don't create it, but just storyboard some ideas for an intro sequence that we could use for the channel on either the Joshua Wolf or the Project Live Fully channel. As an update on our bigger benchmark goals, the quantifying goals, we had the photo challenge, so the Facebook group, and the goal was to hit 100 members. And so we hit 91 as of this morning on Monday. So we're at 91 out of 100. Hopefully we'll hit it next week for sure. And I wanted to have 20 people comment and submit photos for our weekly challenge. This week we hit 18 official posts. So next week I'm hoping that we'll hit the 100 and get the 20. For the Joshua Wolf channel, we're at 17 subscribers and I'd like to get to 50. Not necessarily again, not this week, but that's the next benchmark is hitting 50. And I'd like to have at least five comments on one of my videos. Project Live Fully is at 41 subscribers, so we'd like to hit 75 and again, get five comments and interaction with our videos. Photo sessions, we're going to try to get five. Currently we have done zero legitimate photo sessions where we actually have, whether it's paid or not, but it's a client that we're gonna go and do a shoot for them. I'd like to do five of those in the short term, near future here. 
money earned. I think the original goal I had was a thousand, but we're gonna lower that to 250 and try to make it an easier benchmark to hit. So I want to do five photo sessions and try to earn $250 across those and other sessions. And then Instagram is at 179 followers right now, which is mostly just people that followed me as a friend prior to starting all of this, but we would like to get that to 250. So those are my benchmark goals and those are my small weekly goals I'm gonna to try to be accomplishing this week. So hopefully I'll be able to check off all seven of those smaller bite-sized goals. And we'll get back to you next week with another update and see how all of those went. So thank you so much for watching and to continue to support the channel, please like this video, share the video around and try to help more people understand what we're doing and get involved and share their dreams with us. And then comment down below what you're thinking, if we can do anything better, what your goal is, whatever you wanna to talk to me about and subscribe to the channel here as well as over at my personal channel at Joshua Wolf and the rest of our different channels and social medias that will also be linked down below. Thank you so much and have a good rest of your day. Bye everybody.